what we in Straight Up hope to accomplish is have an other avenues of Straight Up branches all over Canada. That's my ultimate goal is to have centers right across Canada to help our individuals because as it is, we have so many youth that are homeless. They don't want to go home because their parents are still under the addiction. They're alcohol, drug addicts, you know, and a lot of these kids are homeless. So you see why the system is starting to fill up with the younger people because they have no homes to go to. So they're getting in trouble to have a place to sleep, to have those three scares three square meals a day. They're not getting them at home because their parents are addicts. I love being part of a straight up and uh, it's, it's what it does it makes me makes me want to continue doing, doing good for myself, it makes me want to continue improving myself, evolving, expanding my my ideas and just I mean just make it up for all the all the years I've I wasted when I was younger. So now is is to, to me it's a it's a totally taking a, a Totally 180 degree, you know. Um, I mean, just change. It's just a, it's a whole new direction that I'm, I'm heading right now. Is I love, I love life right now, and I love to be a, to be part of the community, and and I love to to be a, on 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 the straight straight path, the straight road. For myself, I'm here to educate the public on the realities of life that ain't talked about enough. A dysfunctional way that there's too many youth, too many of my family members, a lot of families out there that are struggling to get away from. The addiction has a pull on us that is sometimes very hard to escape from. So it's to me, it's important that everybody is aware of what's going on out there and also aware of what's going on in their own life. So what I hope to get out of this conference is have more of our communities have an understanding of how to address, not tackle, not fix, because there's no fix in this problem. You can tackle it and try suppress it, it's not gonna work. You're gonna need more and more jails if you're gonna suppress it. But if you're like us, intervention prevention, at least you're giving these younger kids hope giving them a future. If you suppress it, what are you doing? You're not giving these young people a future. You're giving them a life within the system.